local four news begins right now with a breaking news alert. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Karen Drew. We start with breaking news. A deadly home explosion in Taylor, and we have just learned two people have now died. Let's bring in Jermont Terry. He is live at the scene. And Jermont, what can you tell us? Well, Karen, fire crews are on scene trying to figure out exactly what exploded inside this house on Buck just off Telegraph and Taylor. Now, if you take a look over my shoulder, you can see that investigators are here and also family members are also gathering. Here's what we do know. Family members on scene telling me a mother and daughter perished in this fire. Neighbors tell me they heard a loud explosion, but it wasn't clear where the explosion came from. About 10 to 15 minutes later, they know the smoke coming from the side of the ranch house. Neighbors knew the elderly mother and her daughter lived in that home, but they were hoping maybe they were not home at the time. One neighbor ran over but could not enter the front door. It was just a little bit on fire. Mm -hmm. And when I opened it up, this big cloud came in my face, so I closed it real quick. And I ran back and it, before, as I was running over there, I told my mom to call 911. All of a sudden we heard a big boom. Uh, we thought it went, was coming from that way. Um, didn't know if it was an oxygen tank or a firecracker or a gun. We had no idea. And back live here on the scene, again, we do know that uh, emergency crews were able to rush the elderly woman to the hospital, but she unfortunately perished in this, and the daughter, come to find out, was in the living room, and firefighters didn't even know she was there until they put the fire out. The medical examiner is currently on scene. A very tragic situation, but again, the fire department is trying to figure out exactly what exploded. They did confirm that it does not appear to be gas-related. They're working to find out if the elderly mother or anyone inside the home actually used an oxygen tank. Reporting live in Taylor with breaking news, Jermont Terry, Local 4. All right, we'll check back with you a little bit later, Jermont, when you learn more details. Thank you so much.